I think you guys can relate to this because this is how I feel every single day of my life. There is something... Oh god. Hi guys, I burned my lip with a freaking cinnamon bun. That's my life, that's my life. And I'm also having a terrible hair day. I'm having a horrible time because I have no idea what to do with this thing. But seriously, I'm trying to grow this thing out and it's getting so long, so fast, and I look like a freaking hedgehog. Oh God. Well, let's move on. Today I'm gonna tell you about my tattoos. Ever since I made my first YouTube video, I've always wanted to make a tattoo video. I don't know why I never made one. Maybe it's because I've been a busy, busy girl. I love tattoos, I think they're absolutely beautiful and I want to be like covered in them someday. When I grow old, <laughs> what was that voice? When I grow old, I want to be this crazy Japanese chin lady covered in these badass tattoos. I currently have two tattoos and they are both on my legs and they are both oddball tattoos, which is a huge surprise to absolutely no one. Before I show them to you, I thought I could tell you a little bit about their background, about their history, why I wanted to have Oddworld tattoos, a little bit of my own Oddworld history. It was 1997 or 8, yeah, and my big brother was playing this demo which had the first game, Apes Odyssey, in it. And I watched him play the game, he thought it was very funny and very entertaining, and finally he asked me to try it. And my response was, I don't want to play that game, it looks stupid and boring. And I have no idea what happened after that. Maybe he like punched me. But the next thing I knew was I was playing the game and I fell in love with it immediately. I fell in love with the characters, the music, the backgrounds, the graphics, which still this day blow my mind off because they look absolutely gorgeous. So I fell in love with the game and I kept playing the demo like 100 times a day. Every day, all day, I just kept playing it until we bought the real game. And a year later, I think the next game, Apes Exodus, was released. And I actually collected all the money by myself to buy the game and I was freaking eight. It was a huge amount of money to collect, but the moment when I finally bought the game with my own goddamn money, it was magical and I will never ever forget it. And as I said, I love tattoos and many, many years ago I made kind of a promise to myself that if I ever get a tattoo, it will be an Oddworld tattoo. And now I have two! And I want so many more! So now I'll show you my wonderful, gorgeous Oddworld tattoos. Somehow. This is my very first tattoo and I got it right after I turned 18, that was 8 years ago. It's one of the cave paintings from the first game and I had other options to choose from but I really wanted to have this one because it has Elum and Elum is one of the most adorable characters in the whole game so that's why I really wanted to have this one. Some people have told me that it's too big and it's not the most prettiest tattoo in the world but you know what, I don't give a sh because I love it and it has a lot of meaning to me. When I got it, I just kept staring at it and I said to myself, Emmy, now you finally have an Oddworld tattoo. This is what you always wanted and now you have it. This is real. So I don't give a damn what other people think because I think it's beautiful. Somebody actually sent me a message. <gasps> I'm loved. Oh, it was just a reminder of my doctor's appointment. Well, I guess that's fine too. My other tattoo I got two years ago and it's on my right leg. It's made by the amazingly talented Ravila Siuntila. Guys, go check him out because he's so talented. I really wanted to have a slick tattoo because they are my all-time favorite characters in the whole Oddworld universe. And I really love the design of the flying ones. And I was actually so scared to get this one because my older tattoo was just this very simple black silhouette type tattoo. And the new one was gonna be much bigger, it would have a lot of color, it was very detailed and I was so afraid that it would look all wrong and I would have to live the rest of my life with this colored blob on my leg. But he did an amazing job and I'm so, so happy of my tattoos. 
So those were my tattoos. I hope you liked them and I hope you enjoyed this video. And guys, if you happen to have any tattoos, especially odd world tattoos, <laughs> well, no, any kind of tattoos, I would love to see them. So please share them with me, leave a comment, leave a like if you enjoyed this, and I will see you all very soon on my next video. See you guys.